I wanna be the very best that no one ever was. To catch them is my real test. To unbox them is my cause. What's poppin' YouTube? Welcome back to another video. If it's your first time on this channel and you enjoy this video, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button for future content. Today's video, we finally received the newest wave of Pokemon Pops, including the one and only Charizard. Really excited about this box, and I can't wait to get a closer look at these Pops. Now, I've seen photos. The Charizard looks amazing, guys, and there's a 10-inch exclusive to Target. I did pre-order it. I can't wait for that to come in. It's the only 10-inch I had to have, and here it is, guys. We got the box opened up. Whew. All right, so first up, we have another Pikachu in the set. Pikachu, I feel like it's part of the license. For some reason, we always get a Pikachu in every wave of Pokemon Pops. And I just feel like it's something that Funko and Pokemon made an agreement with. You know what? It's not a big deal because Pikachu is an awesome character. But I feel like eventually, I'm just going to get tired of getting all the Pikachus. I might stop doing it. But for now, I'm keeping it up. And I have every single Pokemon Pop that has released so far. And then after that, we have... Horsey, this one is absolutely adorable. I really like the way this one came out. I like the Pokemons for water Pokemons. They all look really cute as Funko Pops, but this one is definitely a nice one. And I think it was a great choice to make as a pop. And then of course, the one we've all been waiting on ever since Funko got the license approval for Pokemon Pops, the one and only Charizard. Funko absolutely nailed it with this guy. It looks perfect. I love the size, the design. This is easily my favorite Pokemon Pop so far. Really hard to decide though because I do love the Cubone as well as Mew, along with the rest of the collection of course. But come on guys, who doesn't love Charizard? I can't wait for that 10 inch to come in from Target. Hopefully as long as my pre-order does go okay because they've been delaying and canceling a lot of their pre-orders. So we'll see what happens. But there's a good chance that this might end up in my top 10 favorites for 2021. Not only did I pick up one Charizard, but I picked up a second as well as a third. I might try to make one of these a shiny custom. And you know what? Even though I don't really like the diamond Pokemon Pops, I think if they made this one a diamond pop, I might actually pick it up. I honestly can't stop looking at this pop. It looks so perfect. It's just, it's beautiful. I can't wait. I hope they make a Blastoise and a Venusaur because if they made a Charizard, we have a very good chance of them making those two as well. So I already mentioned how awesome it would be to get Blastoise and Venusaur next, but there's so many other Pokemons I'd love to see in Funko form. Jigglypuff, Geodude, Poliwag, Togepi, Onyx, Lapras, even Snorlax. There's so many I can name, and we actually do have three awesome ones coming out soon. We have Pidgeotto, Dragonite, and Caterpie. Caterpie I've been wanting for a while just because that's the first Pokemon Ash ever caught, and it looks perfect in Funko form. So as much as I do love all the Pokemon character pops we've been getting, and there's a lot more I'd like to see, I'd also love to see some of the trainers, specifically Ash, Misty, and Brock. It would also be cool to have them all just like this, Ash holding a Pokeball with Pikachu on his side, and then we also got Misty holding Togepi. Now Brock, his main character is Onyx, but that's one of the main Pokemons I'd love to see as a pop because that's actually one of my favorite Pokemons too. Now we cannot forget about Team Rocket. They would look awesome as Funko Pops. We already do have Meowth as a Funko Pop, but I'd also love to see the rest of these guys. Arbok, Weezing, Lickitung, Victory Bell. They look super cool. Now I think it's about time we get these Pops out of the box for a closer look, but I also have something else in mind. So let's turn the camera around for a closer look. Currently I do have every single Pokemon Pop that has released minus the 10 inches, the diamonds and the flocks. So what we're gonna do today is take a closer look at every single Pokemon Pop that has released. Let's go ahead and take a closer look at every single Pokemon Pop that has released so far. Like I mentioned earlier, I just don't have the remolds. So diamond, flocked, 10 inch, or the new silver ones as well. But for every single different Pokemon, I do have them all. And I hope Funko keeps making more because these are fantastic. So with all the ones we have so far, we have a total of 27 different Pokemon. And I already shared that we do have three more coming out soon. And I named a few I want to see in the future. And there's so much more they could do. Let's go ahead and get these three out for a closer look. You guys know what time it is. Let's go ahead and get to the magic in three, two, one. And they're out. Here we have a closer look at all three of the new Pokemon Pops. And guys, the Charizard is off the leash. 
Funko did a perfect job with this pop. It's easily the best Pokemon pop by far. Like I said, Cubone and Mew are adorable, but this one is perfect. I can't wait to see the 10 inch. And I think this has a high chance at being in my top 10 favorites for 2021. But there's so much more coming out by the end of the year. So we'll see what happens. Pikachu, we already have a ton of, but it's still a cute pop. Horsey, I really like the way they made the pop. It's a nice design. The way they put on the base, it looks really cute. Let's get those 360 spins. Let's go ahead and start the 360 spins off with the new Pikachu. Super cute. And it's crazy because the very first Pokemon pop was the Target exclusive Pikachu. Flippers were flipping them. Collectors were paying crazy prices for them. Now we have a ton of them and it's just hilarious. Like I said earlier, I really like what they did with Horsey. The design looks great and I love that it's on the stand. Really cute looking pop. I'd like to see some more water Pokemon, but this is definitely one of my favorite ones they made. And then of course, here is the Charizard Funko absolutely killed it with this design i feel like funko knew if they messed up on this one people were not going to be happy so they did it justice and it looks perfect all right so we're back to the shelf and now charizard has joined and he looks awesome right on top he's the best looking pokemon pop for sure these are my favorite ones charizard squirtle this pikachu and then the bulbasaur the cubone and mewtwo mew is another really nice one also guys, if you've been on this channel, you know how much I love Disney. It's one of my main collections. I cannot wait for that glow in the dark Dante Alabria pop to come out from Boxinch. That's one of the Coco pops. This one over here, the Pepita, was one of my favorites from last year. So that Dante, I have a huge feeling it's gonna join the Charizard and possibly be in my top 10 for 2021. I actually really love the movie Coco, and this is actually one of my favorite sodas too. The Chase Miguel Funko Soda. Speaking of sodas, they should really consider doing some Pokemon Funko Sodas. So that's all I have for you guys today. Hope you guys enjoyed this video as always. Thank you all for watching. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button for future content. Let me know in the comments below what do you guys think of all the Pokemon Pops we've gotten so far. Which of them are your favorites and what would you guys like to see in the future for the Pokemon Pops? I already named a few, but honestly, let them make any new Pokemon, I'll be happy. I don't want any more Pikachus. I love Pikachu, but there's too many already. There's so many more they could do. Go ahead and name your favorites in the comments below. I just want to say thank you guys so much for taking time every day to watch this video. Let me know in the comments below what would you guys like to see in the next ones. Thank you all for watching and peace.